Hello, my old school soul food family. Chef Jeffrey back with another video. All right, y'all. This, is, uh, uh, of course, it'll be Friday morning when y'all get this video. This is TGIF fish segment of the week, and I'm gonna continue in this segment because some people like it, some people don't. So I'm gonna keep doing it. My different variations of different fish you can do. So you saw by the thumbnail and the title today, I'm doing some mahi mahi. I happen to get from my perfect food haul. About a month ago, and I had it in my freezer. Thought of that. I'm gonna make a nice mahi mahi. Reminds me of a tropical, like Hawaiian theme type fish. So I'm gonna make a like a pineapple salsa that I love to go with my mahi mahi or fish. Even go well with chicken. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna make a pineapple salsa with it. I'm gonna all I'm gonna do is pan sear this fish off with a little salt and pepper. Serve it with some rice and green beans. Nice, healthy, quick fish. You can eat on a Friday night. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to step off here, y'all. I got a pineapple here. I'm going to get everything fabricated and prepped up. Pineapple. Got a little jalapeno, some limes, red bell pepper, a little cilantro, and red onions, a little salt and pepper. That's all that's in this salsa, y'all. I'm going to get it all chopped up. I'll be right back. Put it together. Get this fish cereal off. And this meal going to come together so, so quickly. So I'll be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back here. Okay, I got everything all chopped up here and ready to go here. Now, this is the sauce I make all the time. Now, I'm making a lot. Of course, you ain't going to need this much for what I'm actually going to do. Hold on, y'all, just a second here. Definitely not going to need all of this for what I'm going to do, y'all. Uh, I like to make this sauce, and I keep it in my refrigerator. It can stay a week or so. And I eat it with other stuff. I eat it with chicken, grilled chicken bread. It's real healthy uh, salsa. So anyway, let me show you how to put it together. Very simple ingredient. You can you can omit or you can add to the things I got here. I got some diced pine, a fresh pineapple diced up. I got some red bell peppers. You can use green if you want. I like the color, the red and the yellow going together. I just like how the colors come together. I got some red onions. You can use white if you want to, but like I say, I like the sweetness of the red onions. I got a little jalapeno for heat. I don't use a lot because I don't like it too spicy. You can definitely use more. A little cilantro here. I got some fresh squeezed lime juice. And a little salt and pepper going to go in here, y'all. A little salt and pepper here. That's going to bring the sweetness out of the pineapple even more. You know, salt brings out the sugar and the fruit. And I'm going to just kind of mix this up right here. Mix that all up there. Got them little tropical colors working right there. See how pretty that is? Like I say, y'all make this all the time. I use it for like a fish. Or I eat it with chicken breast. Just a good, it just works well with fish. And chicken bread, it really does. Real chicken bread, saute your chicken bread, put that over there. And this, y'all, I'm gonna mix it with my rice. You'll see later, I'm gonna mix some of this with the rice. But I'm gonna let this hang out a little bit. And uh, it's best to do this the night before, because the longer it's set up, the better the flavors marry together. But I'm gonna have all the ingredients at the bottom of the video, but like I say, this I'm making a lot. The recipe is gonna call for maybe you'll make a couple of cups of this for for that but i make a whole lot because like i say i use it for other things so anyway i'm gonna get my skillet heating up i'll be right back here in about two minutes and we'll get this fish started we'll be right back okay y'all i'm back here i got my skillet heating up here i really want it really hot here now all i'm gonna do to this fish y'all simple 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 salt and pepper that's it all I'm putting on this fish. That's all it needs. You don't need no seven, eight different kinds of spices on there. I'm going to dust in a little flour. This fish ain't going to take but two or three minutes to cook. My mahi doesn't take long. The way it's cut thin, doesn't take long at all to cook out. A little salt and pepper on the other side. Alrighty. I'm going to dust in a little flour here. like I did another dish, put it in the skillet. That's it, y'all. 
I'm going to sear this off on both sides. Very little oil. y'all we're gonna let this cook about two minutes on each side get a nice golden brown color on each side and uh this fish should be ready like i said this dish is very easy i got some green beans here These nice green beans i got cooked gonna go with it i got some rice right here that i'm gonna add a little salsa to and that's gonna be a meal Nice, quick, easy, really light meal, y'all. Not very really healthy, really. So anyway, I'm gonna let this fish cook brown. Flip it over. When I'm ready, flip it over, take it out. I'll be right back. We'll be right back, y'all. Okay, y'all, we are back here. Okay. Now, while that's getting ready, the fish is ready. I got it cut off here. Let me turn it off. Now, all I'm gonna do now, y'all, like I said, I got some green beans for this. I'm going to put my green beans on here. Very simple dish, y'all. I was serving it family style. And I got a video, y'all, on my green beans. How to make the perfect green beans. Now, on the salsa here. Get in y'all right here for a second. I'm going to put a little of this salsa in the rice. Now, I'll do it with my spatula here. What I do, I'm gonna mix it up in here. Like I said, I like to uh, combine a little bit of sauce in the rice, give you a lot of pineapple rice there, a little Hawaiian theme there. Mix that up in there. A little bit more. And this tastes so awesome together, y'all. Okay, I'll spread that down on the plate like right here. Nice fluffy rice with the pineapples in it. Can't go wrong with this, huh? Then we'll put the fish right here in the middle. I'll take my fish. I very seldom plate live, y'all. I usually do my thumbnail and plating off camera, but Put that right there. Put a little salsa right in the middle of the fish, just like that. And that's it. See that right there, y'all? That's a meal made so easy. So, so, so easy. So I'm gonna do a thumbnail here right quick, y'all. And I'll be right back and we'll taste this out. We'll be right back. All right, y'all, we are back for the final taste here. Let me try this fish here. Fish with that little salsa. Mm. I'm telling y'all. Yeah. This is, you can't get much healthier than this, y'all. And you actually don't have to put the, the flour on the fish if you don't want to. You can, uh, mm. you can leave it off. It's getting the gluten free stuff. Show these green beans how tender they are. Mm, mm, mm. Let me show you here. how tender these green beans are. See that? And they have that color still on them. The key to that, I have a video on that. The proper way of cooking green beans, when they're tender, and keep that color. But anyway, y'all, another TGIF Fish Friday in the books, y'all. Like I said, this is a new segment I started about a month ago. It's been picking up traction. The different ways I cook fish. I'm going to show y'all different dishes throughout the way. 
like I say, this is very simple. And also, y'all see how much salsa I have left over. And this goes in the fridge. And like I said, I'll eat this on chicken. And it's good on chicken breast. And some rice and some vegetables. You can't go wrong. So anyway, let me close this video out. If you like this video, please share, please comment, please subscribe. Please follow me on the social media accounts, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch TV, Pinterest, and OldSchoolSoulFood.com. Remember to hashtag this year, 2021, help somebody, Old School Soul Food. Until next time, have a blessed Old School Soul Food day, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Y'all have a happy Friday and a happy blessed weekend. I'll see y'all in the next video. Love y'all. Bye.